Fantasia, how are you today? I'm blessed. How are you, Bonnie? I am blessed too, and more so because you did such a phenomenal job in this movie. Kudos to you. I have to ask you, my friend, how much harder was it taking Celie from your amazing stage performance and bringing us what you did on screen? It was, it was very hard. It was very different because, you know, Broadway is really quick once the stage <laughs> starts moving, you know? And so you have time to live with it, but you really don't. And being on set in front of the cameras and when they're yelling action, the, the, the director, thank you, Blitz. Thank you to Coleman, Taraji, uh, Danielle, Corey, real actors and actresses. You live with it. You live with it. You feel it. There's moments that Blitz would just let things, what they call, breathe. You know, this was my first big film. And I felt like when they would yell action, I'm thinking, well, where do I look? What do I do? But being with so many greats and a actually watching all of us switch into the role and live in it, it was very different. You live in it, you feel it way more. And yeah. that was something that I had to um, really get used to for six months. I mean, yeah, you say it's your first role, but, you know, honestly, I would call you a liar because you're so amazing. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank but you. To, but I have to ask you, I mean, look, we all know you have such a powerhouse voice. You're so fantastic. But Fantasia playing Celie, I mean, she's such an extraordinary character of what she goes through her arc. How did she change you? That's a good question. Okay, I'm going to keep it very, very honest and real. That's all I know to do. Um, when I, before they called me for the role, I had just started doing traumatic therapy. Now, traumatic therapy is what, uh, they, they go back into your childhood and they try to help you heal certain things that may be hindering you or in the way of your adulthood. And so, um, I had to stop that in order for me to play Seely. My therapist would text me a lot and say, I'm kind of feeling like we should do some sessions. And I told her, we can't do any sessions. Celie was my healer through that time. So I had mentioned we were in cinema con at CinemaCom in Vegas, and I had mentioned that they asked me, what, what, what do you think this movie is going to do? And I said, I don't think I know it's going to heal people because it healed me. Now people were thinking, wait, you've been healed. You're married. You're happy. We've been watching you. And I'm like, no, you don't understand. I had to stop traumatic therapy and, and the things that I was starting to work on with younger Fantasia and give younger Fantasia over to Seely. And that is what healed me and helped me. So thank you, Seely. Wasn't easy, mm. but I had to do it. Well, you did it amazingly. And just quickly, I have to ask my last question. You know, the character of Suge helps other women, you know, namely Seely, to embrace how strong they can be. Yeah. Fantasia, who did that for you? Oh, don't make me cry. Um, that's gonna be my mother and my grandmother, but my grandmother's gone home to be with the Lord now. My grandmother was my number one fan, and I could call her when it seemed like everything was going wrong. I can't call her now, but I can hear her. That's when you know you have a powerful woman in your life. She's not on earth, but the words that she said and the wisdom that she dropped with me um, still lives in my heart and it still lives in my ear. And then my mother is my grandmother. So I'm gonna say my mother is my best friend. She is a real life Seely. And I watched her growing up go through so many things and I look at her now and I think she's growing backwards. She really has the Benjamin Button. She looks good. She, she, she's, she's a classy queen and I watched my mother go through things but never give up on people even when people did her wrong. She's still and that's what love is, and that's what God is. So I'm going to give it to my mother and my grandmother. Well, your grandmother's looking down, very, very proud. And my goodness, you are just a, just a, I, I, I have no words. You're so phenomenal in this. Best of luck to you. I'm sorry I didn't mean to make no. your, your mix, because I was bottling the whole movie. So you owe me. There you go. <laughs> Thank you so much for your time, my dear. Thank You're you. Love you. Thank you so God much. God bless you. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you. God bless. Yes.